Hey friends, welcome back. And if you're new here, I welcome you. I have a Bath & Body Works candle review of their three wick candle in the scent whipped coffee. So I'm just gonna zoom in a bit closer so you can see the cute jar design. And this one has a gold label on the front, which is really cute. And you have an image of like a, maybe it's a cappuccino or something like that. I'm hoping you guys can see that. But it's really lit up with the warmth of the flames, as you can see. It's very nice and cozy, perfect for um, cozying up in a blanket and grabbing a book and just doing some good reading. Um, you have a front sticker, which isn't a wraparound sticker, which displays some big shop utensils like um, you've got some mixers, some coffee beans, some spoons and even um, like that cappuccino looking drink that's on the front label here. So this is a very warm scented candle. It's super cozy and um, it's very sweet, which puts you in mind of a gourmand sweet candle. So let's take a look at the wax and the wicks. The wax is just a white wax. It has pulled out nice and evenly, so no issues there. This candle has been going for a little over an hour now, and you have the tall skinny wicks, uh, which have just curled over just a little bit, but the flames have been this way since I've lit this candle, and I'm getting a really nice throw. So just looking at this, jar it's really beautiful and i love the warmth that it gives off uh, while burning so i do want to share the scent notes with you all which are a shot of espresso whipped sweet cream two pumps of caramel syrup sugar crystals with essential oils in my opinion this candle should have been called caramel and milk and i say that because the prominent note that i get from this one is that heavy caramel syrup note so for my caramel lovers you would really enjoy this candle um i really thought that this would be a good coffee blend candle more like um cappuccino scented um but i don't get that i get a really heavy caramel syrupy note blended with the whipped sweet cream and it is a sweet cream it's a really cozy sugary sweet creams this one is nice and fluffy um, it's definitely super sweet um, in my opinion I don't think I could have this burning for a long time because that caramel syrupy note is really heavy this one right now is not particularly my favorite it isn't a alternative to paris cafe as paris cafe is much stronger um, in that coffee note so i think what they really should have done is just stuck with the same coffee note in the paris cafe and just gave us the sweet cream or some sort of like um, different milky type note and just keep out the caramel. Um, I'm not sure why they threw the caramel in there. I really was wanting more of a coffee scented candle, definitely something, an alternative to Paris Cafe. I don't own Paris Cafe at the moment, but I've always been like, ah, it may be a bit too strong for me. So that's my only reasons as to why I haven't added it to my collection yet because on cold, it is just so aggressively strong. But I love that. It's great for when you're just wanting to light up your home and just have your home smell like fresh brewed coffee. I think it's great. And the aesthetics of the jar is beautiful. The throw is a solid seven. And you will get a nice throw from this one, but that throw, you're gonna get nothing but caramel and pretty much sugary whipped cream. So if you're into those notes, um, you definitely would enjoy this candle. I personally will not be backing up this one. It's a little bit too sweet for my taste. But leave me some comments down below as to what have been your thoughts on the whipped coffee three wick candle did you guys pick this one up or are you thinking about adding it to your collection um, i just want to reiterate that you're not gonna get that sharp espresso note 
from this candle. Um, it's definitely more caramel and whipped cream. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this candle review. Again, leave me some comments down below and also be sure to turn on your notification bell so you're notified every time I upload and also be sure to subscribe and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye!